I was trying to decide why there's a blood stain directly in front of this uh, chest, but uh, naturally it's not a mimic. That would be dumb. I guess he just ran afoul of something there. <laughs> Either the knight or another player or something. Okay. Well, the video just started recording. And we got a Dragonite armor to deal with. I do not know what the very best idea is. I'm thinking Cathedral Knight armor. Is the way of the future. I've never really needed the fast roll, so... This will probably do. But I should rethink some of these ring choices, I think. Definitely get the damage that I can out of anything I can. Uh, need Havels for that. Probably the Clothiary ring. Although I kind of want the Estus ring too. Because I really need that that little bit of... Uh, oh, I don't need the, the Flynn's ring in this situation. So we do it that way. Okay, cool. We're still rolling. We're at 69%. We got pretty good lightning and physical defense in this armor. So, yeah. Time for lightning. Couldn't agree more. Oh. That shield's gonna be a problem. to make sure we keep some stamina around for dodging. Thankfully, that's free hit. The rest of the time is just going to be a bit of RNG on the butterflies, probably. That I just did wrong. Like if I if I mistime my dodges and get hit, that's my own fault. Because he's actually pretty good at telegraphing his attacks. So many people die to that. <laughs> oh, whoa. Yeah, that was my fault. Definitely expect a uh, visit from the butterflies any time now. Which means you got to keep moving up and down across the bridge as best you can. However, as you can see, as long as the fight doesn't get much more complicated than this, I'm actually okay. Oh crap! Okay. Dodging the fireballs, mistimed with the shield. Oh! I thought he was going to start earlier than that. And here come the fireballs. He's got the shield up. Designed, but is perfectly entertaining, I must say. Oh crap. Oh, that actually missed me. I dodged it correctly, even though it didn't look like it. Oh, no. That's 
time I got my just desserts. Oh no. Just bad timing all around there. I'm having trouble keeping my crossbow loaded when I need it. Okay. I didn't know that one. I so seldom see it. I'm not usually keeping my distance from it this much during this fight. Oh! That goes through the scenery, apparently. Okay. Learning is happening. One is just left though. Oh crap, I shouldn't have done gone for that. What am I doing? Oh crap, he's gonna adjust. <laughs> of course he is. Oh crap. Oh no! flattened at the very end. I couldn't... I was trying to get a hit in under his shield that whole time. It just kept... He kept blocking at the wrong time. Trying to end the fight too quickly. Close. Very close. But, uh... No cigar. <laughs> Got to admit, he was doing a bunch of moves that I don't usually see him do during this fight. I guess when I'm in melee, I usually just stay really close to him and dodge all his attacks, and it works out really well. Since I'm trying to keep my distance a lot here so I can reload, he's doing a bunch of gap closer moves that I don't normally see from him. Yeah, you gotta be much more careful with that reloading. Oh. Also, I can usually dodge that shield move quite easily. For some reason, I'm getting face hit a lot more than I would normally have happen. Oh, my souls are over there. Maybe I should go get them. Yeah, I'm kind of in a corner, though. That won't be good if he uh, gets me there. Well, got him. Not many. See? Oh. Reloading. Just an idiot about reloading. Also, do not hit him on the second hit of a combo. He can do a third hit whenever he wants. the dodge it just hit me anyway oh crap what am I doing he has three hit combos stop stopping on the second one requires some finesse on my part. And we'll be fine somehow. This again? Okay. Cool. Whatever you like, buddy. Nothing hit me there. And then... No? No follow-up? Okay. Oh. Okay. Didn't 
hit me, but it does have a follow up for that one too. Oop. Damn it, I can't see anything. Damn it, man. Stop with a very bad tying. Oh! Crap, I couldn't see it. It's the one attack in this fight that I really dislike. Which is the laser by itself isn't a problem. It's the fact that if you're backing up, there's no way for your camera to catch it before it starts hitting you. Because the audio cue only happens when it gets set down on the floor, not when it explodes. Oh, I felt like I probably dodged that one, but... The people disagree. Normally it's not that hard to get around his melee attacks. Get some damage in that way. Should probably emulate that strategy more actually. Come on over. There, under his armpit. Not bad. One, two, three, in your face. Okay, cool. Something big coming. Yeah, there's the laser. Oh. oh. What are you gonna do, Dragon Slayer? Need a need a better window here. One, two. Okay, that's a good one. Come on, we're almost there. <laughs> that was cheeky on me. <laughs> there we go. Not so bad. Off you go, butterflies. Your time is done. And that is the Dragon Slayer armor. Touch ourselves a bonfire. And I think before the video is over, we can take a huge risk and make the epic journey to the next bonfire. Who knows how many leagues it will take, but... I believe, I believe in the next bonfire. <laughs> Is there anything over here? I can never quite remember. Some of it might be New Game Plus stuff again that I just forget about. Aha! Success! The next bonfire! <laughs> I know there's a format involved in this, but that was silly. Grandmaster Archives T and the God Hand Twin Swords. Okay. Well, that is that. Thank you for watching. We are making our way surely but slowly to the end of the game. So, see you on the next episode where we will take on part of the gr the Crystal Archives, I think. Bye for now. I'm going to get far enough through the Grand Archives that we can pick up Grey Rat's corpse without having to worry too much. And then we'll pretty much do an about face and we'll head on to other things. Well, it's not much of a secret, it'll just be, uh, we'll be going for Osiris after that. I don't know how much the exploding and bleeding bolts is going to help in the long run, but if I don't try them, I will never know. Oh well, I 
got him a bit that time. I do not necessarily know what the best way to tackle this area is. There's certainly a lot to do in this area, but... Very little of it ever really stood out to me. And these little guys are gonna be a pain in the butt. Oh crap, I'm stuck. I'm stuck in the corner. Thank god he didn't wake up and start doing things again. Because they will wreck your face at close range. Cathedral Knight armor isn't gonna save me from everything. The good thing about this build is I can peel them off the walls before they actually aggro. And these guys aren't going to be too tough. Nope. Well, I say that, but. Still got to be able to lock onto them, or this isn't going to. Seemed like I was about to, uh... Oh, this one's a bit tougher than the others. I didn't realise that this one was special compared to the others in, in some way. I always just sort of run in and murder them. <laughs> the things you learn. Now, this, unfortunately, is going to be... A bit of a pain. Oh, thankfully he's slow walking for all he's worth. Shield? Nope. Ah. I don't know how I keep getting away with that. <laughs> the very worst thing to do is to, when you're being charged at with a spear is to roll directly backward, but for some reason I keep thinking that's the thing to do. Though it's clearly a very stupid thing to do. Now, well, thankfully we don't have to kill this guy every time we come down here. Guys with tower shields are the worst when you're fighting with a crossbow. Nothing quite takes as long. Oh, see, you shouldn't do it. You just shouldn't do it. I'm clearly in your range. You should shoot me. Nope. You finally bit off more than you can chew. Yeah, I just, I just don't know this place very well. Been through here more than my fair share of times, but it's just like... Where is stuff? How much stuff is there? There's obviously the Avalon in this area, but... Which I suppose would have made this a lot more exciting if I'd been doing an unrestricted crossbow playthrough, but... What the hey? Does kind of make everything sort of meh. Oop. What am I doing? Stop being an idiot. I kept thinking there was more over there, and I'm like, wait a minute, there's nowhere to go. What are you doing? Wax on! <laughs> Pretty much just wax on, actually. Anything else to it? Yeah, there's a lever around here somewhere. It is. 
that should open a secret passage or door to some. Oh. Didn't realize I was dealing with crystal lizards in here. It's all good. It's all good. Now, you're not a mimic, but. Even though I know it, I can't trust it. Anyway, that gives us the witch's locks. This, this room is rather unremarkable for a secret room. In a place like this. Containing a very questionable item. But, uh, whatever. Why can't I lock onto you? Because, just because it's dark doesn't mean I shouldn't be able to lock onto people from that distance. That's silly. Whoa, again! Why did my camera spin instead of locking onto the person I'm trying to... I swear I'm trying to lock on right now. There must be something to do with the dark in this room. Oh, that kind of scared me. Uh <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm going to run out of uh, the wax head a bit early this time because I'm not moving very fast. Oh. To be perfectly honest, I've never noticed that ladder. Ever. Whoops. Okay, let's, let's duck out here for a second. Now, where am I going? I think he's up here. I found him doesn't mean I can kill him. I don't do enough damage to him, unfortunately. Nope. I think I'm going to have to say screw the items and just sort of go for it one way or another. Good. The Crystal Sage is enough of a problem that I do not want to draw this out too long. Nope. Oh. Guy with his cursy wax. At least he didn't wax me. Take that. Now, I don't know where he's gone now, but... He probably went downstairs, to be honest. Oh wait, no. Seems like he did actually... Oh go very far at all. Oh crap. There we go. Oh, the other side of the bridge did. He's just gonna start alternating between this side and that side, is he? In that case... Uh, 
Okay, this I can handle. As long as he keeps following this pattern. Yeah. This is, it, is it a pattern he can't get out of. Oh! Don't need interference from an interloper there. Go down. There. That is tangible progress. Oh, crap. Bastard. Baron bolts come out really quickly. <laughs> and when they're cast by these douchebags, they actually hit pretty hard. Now, is this elevator the one that goes to the archive floor? Oh wait, this is just...